The same police uniform, driving on the same side of the street, same uh, uh, currency, same government structure. Because why? You were colonized. The church was birthed to be colonized. We were birthed as a colony of the kingdom of heaven. So when people come to church, they should see what's going on in heaven. This place should be full of faith and love. I'm a, I'm a heaven here. Yeah, because when God got you, ain't, see, people don't see heaven, they see us. Yeah. We're the colony. Yeah. They should look at us and see, okay, that's how things are done in heaven. Right. They got order in there. That's how things are done in heaven. Yeah. The word runs that church. That's how things are done in heaven. Yeah. Love, love is in that church. That's how things are done. Oh, God. Yeah. 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 Let me explain these two governments. This is what apostles do, you know, right? That's what they do. See, there are two governments. You have the kingdom government. Yes. Y'all know that they had a governor's mansion in Jamaica. They had one in Nassau, yes. too. Yes. Or whatever island you're from. They had the governor who the king sent. Yes. England sent the governor to live in that house. And when England wanted to speak, they spoke to that house. Yes. Yes. That house spoke to the local government. Uh -huh. But the local government was not chosen, was elected. The people voted for the prime minister, yes, voted for the cabinet. Yeah, yeah. They didn't vote for the governor. Yes, yes. They, they voted for bishops and deacons and elders and stuff. The Bible says, if man desired an office, yes. he must meet these certain criteria. Yes. So you can say, listen, brother, you don't meet this criteria. You can't be no bishop. But when it comes to God's anointed and appointed, there's nowhere in the Bible you will find this criteria for an apostle, a prophet, a pastor, evangelist, a teacher. You know why? You don't get to vote on that. I'm going to help you all here. Oh, yeah. I'm going to help you. Because oh, yeah. I come here for the right reason. Yeah. See, you don't get to vote on Pastor Lee, Apostle Lee. That's the offense. 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 I'm going to start preaching if I don't stop here. He gave some apostles. He sent us. You didn't get to choose us. He chose us and sent us to you as gifts. He gave gifts unto man. Kingdom government, some apostles, some prophets, some yeah, yeah. pastors, teachers. Now you get to vote on your deacons. <laughs> That's why I don't understand how these Baptist churches and deacons run the church. We don't even have deacons in our church. <laughs> we ain't even taking that chance. <laughs> 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 You know what, I'm making a declaration that we, 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 we start our deacon's ministry, but, but actually, I guess the point is to start a deacon's ministry. Anyway. Listen, understand the difference in two levels, unless you get caught in spiritual things mixed up. I have a friend who tells me the bishop is the same as an apostle, you got to do more research on that. So, that's not so at all. Bishop is an administrator. Yes. An apostle is used pastor, apostle left with spiritual things. You hear me? Hard of compassion because you got to prepare for where God's taking them. An apostle becomes wow. a mouthpiece for God. Yes. An apostle is a part of the foundation of the church. Yes. The prophet, the evangelist, the pastor, and the teacher is a part of the apostle's cabinet. Yes. Come on. Can I talk to you here? Can I teach you here? When Jesus laid the foundation of his church, Peter said, Thou art the Christ, the Son of the living God. Jesus said, Bless that thou son of my Jonah. And I say unto you that you are Petrus. The word Petrus, we, we keep thinking that's a name. It's not a name, it's an office. Because when he first met Peter, he said, You shall be called Cephas, a stone. So when Cephas got came connected to a, something greater, he called him Petrus. Which means that he's a part of something greater than himself. A person operating something that's greater than himself. Can I keep talking? Can I keep talking to y'all? Can I keep talking? That's why these apostles have to be chosen. Even the prophet don't operate on the level of the apostle. The prophet, but that's the apostle's cabinet. A prophet has to be subject to the apostle. Am I teaching this as the apostle? That's why the enemy tried to take apostles out of the church. That's why the devil tried to convince the church there's no more apostles. Because if you take the apostle out, there's a disconnect between the church and the kingdom. Yeah. Yeah. That's why the church has gone for these last hundred years into the three points in the hope. Yes. There's no revelation. Without the office of the apostle, heaven is not speaking. Yeah. I feel like preaching. Yeah. Yeah. 
Shut up, feel like music. Y'all better don't get me started, I'm gonna start hooping here. Shut up, oh, son. When, when Paul says we are stewards over the mysteries of God, he wasn't talking about the church. He was talking about his office. So where is Paul, where is Apostle Mohan, where is Apostle Thompson, Apostle Leslie in that office? It's where the mysteries are revealed.